council held by the rats. A fable by Jean de La Fontaine and translated by Eliza Wright. Old Rodela, a certain cat, such havoc of the rats had made, twas difficult to find the rat with nature's debt unpaid. The few that did remain to leave their holes afraid from usual food abstain, not eating half their fill, and wonder no one will, that one who made on rats his revel, with rats passed not for cat but devil. Now on a day the dread rat eater, who had a wife, went out to meet her, and while he held his cat or walling, the unkilled rats, their chapter calling, discussed a point in grave debate, how they might shun impending fate. Their dean, a prudent rat, thought best and better soon than late to bell the fatal cat, that when he took his hunting round, the rats, well cautioned by the sound, might hide in safety underground. Indeed, he knew no other means, and all the rest at once confessed their minds were with the deans. No better plan, they all believed, could possibly have been conceived. No doubt the thing would work right well if anyone would hang the bell. But one by one, said every rat, I'm not so big a fool as that. The plan knocked up in this respect. The council closed without effect. And many a council I have seen, a reverend chapter with his dean, that thus resolving wisely fell through like this precisely. To argue or refute, wise counselors abound. The man to execute is harder to be found.